MG Picker Studio is full-fledged guaranteed time saver that is both simple and easy to use. Picker designers can pack select buttons, shelf buttons, facial controls, and pose library all together into one single picker. This is all portable and can be easily integrated into any production pipeline. The fastest way to create picker, using the picker template. The picker templates enable a new picker to be easily created under a minute. There are several factory default generic picker templates that come pre-made with every MG Picker Studio, including a widget library where ready-made picker buttons can be borrowed for customized pickers. Build up personal templates to fit better into customized production pipelines. Quick Picker Design Workflow 1. Create a new picker. Hold Control and hit N, or hold Control while double-clicking on an empty area to create a new picker. Allocate the picker name, the namespace, startup panel name to start creating the picker. 2. Do a snapshot for the background image. Click on the top right triangle of each picker panel and select Prepare Snapshot. Adjust in the 3D viewport for the desired background image and finalize the snapshot. A image processing filter could be applied to each snapshot before having it displayed in the picker panel. These image style preset are customizable. The created snapshot can further be edited using the image editing dialog. 3. Create select buttons with a single click. Select the controls and choose Add Select Buttons via 3D View. Every select buttons will be created and positioned on the picker based off the world position in the 3D view. The buttons will be colored using the Maya control colors. Use Control and the L key to label the selected buttons. Double click to label them manually. Use the Unfold feature to unfold the overlapping buttons. 4. Build up mirror relationship. Switch to Mirror tool using the M hotkey. Select the buttons on one side, then right-click to select Auto-Assign Mirror Relationship. This builds up the mirror relationships between the left and right corresponding buttons, which can be extremely useful while designing or using the picker. Using the Alt key, the button's positions can now be adjusted simultaneously, including any property attributes applied. 5. Link the select buttons. Switch to the Link tool via the L hotkey and simply link the select buttons. With the select buttons linked, a double-click action performs a hierarchy selection. 6. Create command buttons. Using the Command Button Presets window, click and insert a predefined command button. Additionally, custom command button presets can be created. 7. Create facial sliders. All facial control can be embedded into a picker in one single action. Hold Shift and double-click on the empty area to add a new panel. Prepare a 3D view and ensure the facial controls and its transform ranges are visible within the view. Select the Add Sliders via 3D view. Control with translation ranges are created into sliders with background frames. Controls that do not have a translation range will be created into sliders without any background frame, but instead with a placeholder range of minus 1 to 1. Slider adjustment speeds can be set to ensure a decent speed for movement while in use. Ensure mirrored relationships are assigned for the sliders, as it is important in designing and helps in usage of the picker. The sliders can also be linked for hierarchy selection use in the future. 8. Create Attribute Buttons Attribute buttons enable embedding a single Maya attribute into the picker and the attribute will be controlled within the picker. Link other picker buttons to a value of the attribute button. This helps to control their visibility through the attribute button. 9. Annotate the picker. Picker buttons could be annotated well with the note property. Use text items to further annotate the rest of the picker for clarity. 10. Fine-tune the buttons and shapes. Fine-tune the shape of each picker item with the numerous available built-in shape library. Images, polygons, or bezier shapes can also be used for aesthetic variation. 
It is possible to further fine tune the properties such as colors, strokes, labels, and sizes. Align or evenly distribute the buttons to ensure the picker buttons are all in their desired position. Use the hotkey T to translate the selected picker buttons globally. Use the hotkey R to scale selected picker buttons locally. Use hotkey I to switch to the eyedropper tool for copying the property between different picker buttons. Use Control plus U hotkey to bring up the Adjust Button Color dialog for adjusting the fill color of the selected picker buttons. Personalized notes can be added to the picker for the animator, which could include a name, contact, website, or any necessary messages. These personalized notes will be visible to animators when in use. Feedback can then be easily directed to the picker's creator. Distribute, publish your picker. There are full solutions to distribute the designed picker in a custom pipeline. Besides that, riggers who would like to publish their rigs to the internet can utilize the publish feature. The publish dialog enables the rigger to pack their rig files, scene images, picker files, and MG Picker Studio program within one single zip package. There are still many features available in the designer mode. And more information can be found while having the mouse cursor hover over certain menus or buttons. Maya animators who only need to use the picker can check out the animator demo. Maya programmers looking for the extensibility of the MG Picker Studio can further check out the programmer video demo. Thanks for watching this designer demo. Please remember to check out twincodes.com or mgland.com to get more useful tools for animators.